Uh, Fedan from Turkey, he says that if I know apostates and I hate what they say, but I don't hate them themselves, would that be an act of kufr for not hating the disbelievers? This is too technical, Fedan. And as again, we're going into details and the devil is in details. This individual, let's assume his name is Ahmed. He apostatized and he left Islam. So now you deal with him in a cordial matter, in a friendly way, you invite him over and as if nothing had happened, of course not. Now, hating his disbelief, hating his apostasy would definitely cascade down to hating anything related to this man. Yes, I'm not going to attack him. I'm not going to beat him up. I'm not going to spit in his face. But nobody can say that I have to embrace him and take him in and invite him for the dinner or lunch or have normal relationships with. So, yes, there is some ambiguity. If he's an apostate and he says things against Islam, we have to hate what he says and we have to hate him personally and not have anything to do with him.